My name is uh, Ed Rubin. I'm a faculty member here in uh, two departments, Mechanical Engineering and Engineering and Public Policy. And as a number of <coughs> my colleagues as well, we all wear different hats in a variety of centers and institutes that uh, <coughs> pull us together in, in various energy-related uh, activities. So the focus of the work uh, we do currently here is really in, in two areas. Uh, at the technology level, we try to understand uh, what the options are for delivering energy in a form that is both affordable and reliable, but also environmentally acceptable. Uh, we look at various technologies to address environmental issues. We look at their economic and other impacts. <coughs> we look at uncertainty in uh, markets and in technology uh, performance. Uh, and we try to, from that, uh, <coughs> distill and identify the most productive paths to uh, getting this ideal situation of energy that is both clean, reliable, and affordable. Uh, the other major focus of the work related to this uh, is on technology innovation, but innovation specifically uh, related to envir environmental technologies, technologies for which there is typically not a natural marketplace <coughs> where people are <coughs> rushing to go out and buy a new product that, uh, that they'd like. So we're, we're very happy and proud that much of the work we do here is having an impact uh, not only around the country but around the world. Uh, one of those impacts is in uh, the use of uh, software that we've developed to do analysis of complex uh, energy systems like electric power plants. Uh, we have a tool that thousands of people are using to analyze options for delivering electricity that is affordable but also environmentally acceptable in the context of their own particular situation. Of course, we ourselves use those tools to try to develop insights and make recommendations both to companies and uh, to government and uh, non-governmental organizations uh, as to what uh, the best paths are to pursue to uh, deploy technology that is Again, from an energy point of view, reliable and affordable, but also environmentally uh, clean and acceptable. 